The British Indian Ocean Territory is one of the world's largest marine protected areas and one of the most diverse marine habitats on Earth. Two of the seven species of sea turtle spend much of their time here. The endangered green turtle and the critically endangered hawksbill turtle. Around the world, both face numerous threats from human activity. Their feeding and nesting sites are being destroyed by development, dredging and climate change. And they are caught as bycatch, snared in fishing nets and often targeted for their shells, meat and eggs. Diego Garcia, the largest island in the territory, is a vital turtle refuge. It provides safe nesting beaches on its oceanic coastline and its lagoon is a nursery ground where juveniles can forage for food and mature. The Bertarelli Foundation has brought together 63 scientists from 20 institutions and seven countries to study the biology of this marine protected area and the ecology of the endangered sea turtles. A study by Professor Graham Hayes of Deakin University tagged female adult green turtles with satellite tracking devices. This revealed that Diego Garcia is a critical nesting site for turtles from across the entire Western Indian Ocean. With the importance of the area established, urgent research is underway to discover even more about the behaviour of both species. Dr Nicole Esteban of Swansea University is working with Professor Hayes and a team of volunteers from the island's military facility to tag hawksbill turtles found nesting on Diego Garcia's beaches. They are also tagging juveniles in the island's lagoon conducting drone surveys to estimate turtle populations and monitoring the health of seagrass beds around the territory, which are important foraging sites for green turtles. These studies will tell scientists even more about sea turtle behaviour and show how we can improve the management of the marine protected area. They will also provide data to science teams from other related disciplines who are all working collaboratively as part of the Bertarelli Foundation's marine science programme so that this important place and others like it in the Indian Ocean and beyond can be better protected. <laughs>